was a sophomore uh, the, year, the year that just passed. And he won, I think, he won Gatorade Player of the Year. First player ever to do that. Uh, he signed, he committed to uh, Michigan State for class of 2022 for uh, basketball. So here we go. Amani Bates from Michigan is this year's Gatorade Player of the Year. He became the first sophomore ever to win the award. And let's go by the numbers with the young hoops stand out. The 6'9 forward is ESPN's number one rated recruit in the class of 2022 after only a sophomore season. Earlier this year, ESPN also rated him the number one overall recruit regardless of class. And that ranking clearly well-deserved. Bates averaged 32 points per game this year for Lincoln after averaging 32 points, a uh, sophomore, here we go, points per game, he averaged 32 points per game as a sophomore in Lincoln High School, so Ypsilanti, Michigan. 28 per contest as a freshman in route to a Division I high school state championship out in Michigan. And speaking of Michigan, two in-state powerhouses among the colleges competing for Bates. Recall Juwan Howard recently took over at Michigan, while MSU has ranked top 10 in the final AP poll the last three seasons. Imani Bates, uh, his father Elgin, brother Elgin, his mom Edith, and coach Jesse Davis now joining us on Sports Center. Uh, Imani, as the 16-year-old rising junior, you're going to give us your commitment decision shortly. But first, man, you joined an impressive list of players to win the Gatorade National Player of the Year Award. LeBron James, Kobe Bryant, Chris Webber, Dwight Howard, among them. But you're the first player ever to win it as a sophomore. How'd you do that? Uh, just by staying in the gym, you know, every day. I know he was going to say that. He's just a hard-working kid. But, yeah, congratulations. I was always in the gym. And just perfecting my craft. How does it feel to be amongst that list of, uh, of really extraordinary basketball players? It feels good. It just show me that hard work paying off. Okay. Mr. Bates, I want to ask you a question. You, you are actually in the process of starting prep school. Why do you believe that's the best option for Amani? Uh, I just think he, it's time to uh, be in a situation where he can continue to grow and develop and also be around like-minded uh, individuals who uh, aspire to play on a higher level and uh, that's committed in the gym and uh, try that, that can also challenge him every day in practice. Hey, Monty, you yeah, I agree. He'd get more at the prep school because it's, it's going to be all guys that's developed and everything and some of the best players too. You played in... AAU game against Bronny James in May of last year. Pre-game, how'd you feel? Good. Oh, because I'm used to playing in like big lights. So it was just another game for me. Hey, Monty, what, what conversations? Yeah, you probably used to playing big games. Because if any, did you get to have with LeBron after that game? I was in the interview during the time, so he just tapped me on the legs like good game. I didn't get to talk to him after that game. Okay. But, you know, the king tapped you on the leg. That's, that's pretty cool. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, Amani, the time has come. Where are you going to be playing college basketball? Uh, I'm not sure what, what the uh, future may hold, but as I do know right now, I will be committed to Michigan State University. There we go, Michigan State. <laughs> I want to uh, 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 say thank you to Coach Edge and Coach OG for, uh, you know, staying with me since I was a youngin. And, you know, just being there through the process and yeah, all the uh, MSU stuff. All right, family Sparty. I like it. Uh, what was it about the program that made you want to go play in East Lansing and Michigan State? Uh, they've been showing love to me since I was, you know, in seventh grade. And, you know, they've been recruiting me hard since then. So I just know they're showing that they love is genuine. And, I'm, and they just been here. Yeah, State is a good program. For a long time. So I, I'm big on loyalty. And then they show me all loyalty. So, you know. I got to show them love back. Mr. Bates, one more for you. How would you feel that, that more schools didn't contact Imani during this recruitment process? Uh-oh. Uh, it really did. I was upset at first, but, you know, the one that he, he really wanted to go to uh, was recruiting heavy, and they've been consistent the whole way. So as long as he got the offer that he wanted and wanted to participate at the school he want, actually wants to play for, I, I'm, I'm happy. Well, they're getting a good one. Imani Bates, top overall player in the class of 2022, will be playing his college basketball at Michigan State. Imani, best of luck to you. Uh, thank you all for being with us. Yeah, that's pretty much it, man. Congratulations, 32 points a game. Uh, they got a couple more years left, but to go. But uh, we'll see what he does. The, the rule might change then, but I don't want to take this moment away from Michigan State and the fans and the coach, the coach Izzo.
So congratulations to Michigan State for landing one of the best players to ever play high school.